hello you guys welcome back to my channel today as you can tell by the title I have a crazy video to share I am going to Israel for 10 days I know this is so crazy I don't even know what to say I will explain how this whole trip came about um, in a clip here in a second but basically I was invited with a group called APAC uh, to go and well I'll explain it right here um to go to Israel on a bipartisan foreign mission trip to meet with the government there learn about foreign policy the American Israeli relations and just everything going on down there it's going to be insane I'm so blessed and excited I really can't even explain how I'm feeling right now but I found out two days ago that I was accepted to go and invited and now I leave in another two days. So that's been a four day turnaround to head from Seattle, Washington to Israel. We're going to Tel Aviv, Bethlehem along the way. It's gonna be absolutely insane and mind blowing. I can't even believe this opportunity. I'll stop rambling because I already know this video is going to be crazy long, but um, cue the packing montage because I have a lot of that to do. LOL at myself who made this like list which is not even like a quarter of probably what I'm gonna need or end up bringing but it was a good start I tried my best yeah okay so since this is technically a work trip um, just because it is kind of like for my career path, I guess you could say. Um, I'm not being like paid to go, but whatever, I'm like being taken on the trip by them. Anywho, um, I do need to bring, uh, professional clothes. So they said no, like heels or anything crazy, but like basically what I wore last summer in Washington DC. If you haven't seen my DC vlogs, go check them out. They were a huge hit. A lot of people really liked them. I loved making them. It was an incredible experience. And if you're going to intern or work on the hill, you definitely are gonna wanna see those vlogs. So go check them out on my channel. Go look, go look. Um, but let's pick out my outfits. Okay, so I have a lot of laundry to do, but right now I have my closet divided in sections of like my normal clothes. Um, and then my like work clothes um, and then I have like a million shoes but we're not going to talk about that um, so I was thinking of wearing a dress since I don't want to have to worry about um, long thick pants in the desert um, so I was kind of thinking of doing some of my dresses uh, this one I wore to my friend's wedding but it's kind of like I don't know I think it's a little bit too dressy um and maybe not as professional so then of course this is my like og dress i don't think i've ever showed it in a vlog vlog but it's this long dress i feel like jackie kennedy when i wear it and there's like this tight um belt it's very cute and there's like these little ruffle shoulders um so i was thinking of that so i'll probably go ahead and pack that one and then find some flats So, I also just recently went and bought these black Tevas. Sorry, my laptop is getting like a ton of my texts. I have never had Tevas before. Um, I've always had Birkenstocks. Um, but these to me are more of an athletic type of sandal shoe. Um, my Birkenstocks, like I showed a couple of vlogs back, are kind of fancier. Um, and I did wear them to Hawaii and they honestly got kind of trashed just because they're dirty with like the sand and everything on them and I did not want to do that. In Israel so I went ahead and bought these Tebas they were like 60 bucks maybe something like that at Bass Pro Shop um, so I'm just gonna wear them around my apartment just to make sure that they fit well and I like them before I take them with me and I will look like a Pacific Northwesterner if I ever was one which I am <laughs> So my neighbors are throwing like a rager right now um, and I'm fingers crossed that they're going to stop because I have to wake up in three hours um, and yeah, if I'm not going to be able to sleep at all tonight, 
I am very upset already. <laughs> Right now, as you can see, I just have the very beginnings of my bags to pack. I went to Target yesterday and went absolutely insane, buying a bunch of travel stuff, um, just special toothpaste, journals, obviously bringing a copy of the Bible because it's the Holy Land. Um, I am I have like a new purse, wallet. I got these adapters overnighted on Amazon. Amazon Prime is the best. Um, I got a scarf to cover my head when I am on, at religious sites. I have some long sleeve shirts. I got this one from, it's like Columbia Sports where I got it from Bass Pro Shop. It's like a hunting fishing thing. Um, it was 45 bucks, so definitely expensive. I'm going to see if I like it compared to everything else I have, but it was like um, anti-perspirant. Like it's very breathable. So when I'm in the desert, um, which is the Middle East, it's going to be much more feasible to actually wear um and then i have a neck pillow for the 12 hour flight um and just some other stuff like that and then i actually had to go and buy a giant suitcase because the one that i brought with me is small and meant for like weekend trips not a 10 day trip uh, across the world so i am just beginning to fill it clearly i'm not even close i have like swimsuits over here and just like random stuff um i'm going to start looking at my itinerary and just get this ball rolling Good morning, everyone. I just woke up like five or 10 minutes ago. Um, today is the day before my trip. Uh, it is about, I don't even know, I don't have a clock in here, but it's early. Um, I'm about to start running errands, get this cleaned up a bit, um, and actually head to meet a friend. She is loaning me some modest dresses and everything to wear. Um, which I really appreciate it. So I'm gonna go pick those up and we'll probably get lunch or something. Uh, yes, this is a picture of George Washington I just have in my room, of course. Um, but yeah, let's get going. So I'm getting situated in my car, um, like I said I'm about to go meet my friend, get some Chick-fil-A actually, we're down. I probably shouldn't eating, be eating greasy food before like a long flight, I feel like that's a rule somewhere, but who knows. Um, I am going to be drinking my emergency, I believe I'm getting a cold, so that's great, um, but I am determined to make it as short lived as possible. So I have been chugging these bad boys day and night. So fingers crossed that this goes well for me and I don't get the worst of it while I'm in the middle of the flight. <clears throat> it happened to me coming back from Hawaii and it was horrible, it was just so bad. Um, so I'm gonna drink this and drive safely. It's a yes for me. Hello, I am driving back from lunch with my friend. I got the goods. I got the clothes I was borrowing from her. So kind that she lent them to me. Um, and I'm pretty sure that that's all I'm gonna need to finish packing. So last night when I left off um, showing my like little packing montage, I did not actually put all of that away into my suitcase yet because my mom and dad are actually gonna drive up tonight um, they live like three hours away from where I live now, and they're going to bring me some more of my stuff from home. I didn't know that I was going to need, obviously, because the last time I was home, I had no idea that I was going to Israel. So they're going to bring some stuff up, and then they asked if they could stay up here with me, get a hotel and stuff, um, so that they would drive me to the airport tomorrow at like 3 a.m. Yeah, um, and I wouldn't have to Uber, which was very generous of them. That was, that's a lot, but... They are living vicariously through me, and they really wanted to be a part of this, so I told them that if they were willing, they were more than welcome to come and do that for me, um, which was really very nice. 
so they're gonna come up in a few hours, but I am going to focus on finishing packing. Whoa, a little light. And then um, if I have any extra time, which I probably won't, but then I will make sure to clean my apartment so when I come home, it's not a trash bit. And then I can also finish up some of my actual work for my job because there's still things I need to do for them. Um, and I wanna make sure that I leave in good standing before I disappear for like 10 days. So I'm gonna pull into my house soon. See you in a sec. Okay, so I am back home and I am trying to clean up this disaster. Um, I'll probably do a little room tour sometime soon um, when this place is better. Um, but I am making pretty good headway packing. I'll go ahead and show you. So here's my suitcase so far. I haven't weighed it yet. Um, let's pray that it is not over 50 pounds. Um, so it's looking pretty good. I think I'm going to return this like white shirt I got um, because I don't think I need it. I'm going to pack my purse. I am in the middle of packing my backpack. We're making progress, um, but I do still have like this whole list of stuff that I need to finish. And I only have a couple of hours until my parents get up here, but I also really want to take a nap, so I'm torn. to take a break and do my toes um i'm gonna be wearing sandals as i talked about so here i am just painting them i'm gonna do this like pinkish color it's gonna be cute uh yes this is gel i purchased this like set a couple of weeks ago or i guess it's a couple months ago now whoa um but it works pretty well and my nails stay nice for longer so obviously not sponsored what the heck am i even saying but it's pretty fun than it always is while I'm on a plane for like 12 hours tomorrow um, so it's gonna be a really crazy day I'm not sure if I'll vlog during the traveling or just like when I get there um, but it's gonna be frantic so um, I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog and try to get a few hours of sleep before I have to be up at 1 30 in the morning it's already like 11 so I don't even know if it's worth it to go to bed I might just stay up and do work who knows um, but thank you guys for watching. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe down below, and I'll see you in my next video when I am in Israel. Okay.